Hello everyone, this is Rosalia speaking. Today's video is going to be kind of a beauty tip or review tutorial on reusable menstrual cups. I usually don't feel comfortable making um, long monologue uh, video chats because I don't um, uh, speak English on a daily basis and some words feel just awkward to me when I pronounce them. But um, I love challenges, hence let's do this. And if you're tired of using um, maxi pads and tampons, you should definitely keep watching. A few days ago I published on my Facebook page and on my Instagram account a picture of my new menstrual cup and I've got such a great feedback and so many questions about this invention that literally changed my life for the better in so many ways. Some of you may have heard or may have read about it or some of you may be already using it or some of you may be still undecided whether to give it a try or not. Well, here I am ready to share with you my experience and to eventually help you um, make up your mind. As far as I know, there are available only the reusable menstrual cups, but thanks also to your messages, I found out that there are also uh, disposable ones. I personally prefer the reusable ones as uh, one of the reasons that helped me decide um, also uh, to start using um, the menstrual cup is the fact that it is sustainable and envir environmental, environmentally friendly. No more useless packaging or tampons uh, thrown away every single month, not to speak of the money that I got to save during all these years. It only costed me like around 25 euros four years ago and that's all I got to spend during all these years. I've been using it for the past four years and I've got the second one only a few days ago. Well, why should you use it? Because it is safe, usually it is made out of um, medical silicone, sterile medical grade rubber or latex, avoiding you all those chemical tampons or pads have. It is practical, it is reliable and most of all it is comfortable. And it is odor free. The blood oxidizes only when in contact with air and as long as it stays inside you in the cup, it will remain odor free. Which, as you know, it is not the case of tampons or maxi pads. It also helps us to better know our body and to feel more confident about it. I felt as scared as you may feel right now uh, when thinking about trying it, but um, in order to get uh, to be a better version of ourselves, we have to get out of our comfort zone. There are so many pros and no contras, if not defeating the fear and actually trying it. You'll never know how it works, if it works for you, if you never try it. The first time I used it, it took me like 10 minutes to insert it and around 15 minutes to be able to remove it. But this is all normal. Uh, it depends a lot on how confident you are with your body and the more you practice, the easier it will become. The first time I used it, I also used to wear pads because I wasn't sure it would work for me. But um, day after day, it all became uh, easier and handier. The major difficulty I encountered was to become practical of handling it while inserting it or removing it. The trick is to practice all the possible positions or uh, the possible folds of the menstrual cups to find one that actually fits you. The stem is supposed to help you reach the base of the cup for removal. You can trim it to the length that's right for you. To put it in you may fold it like this or like this. The second one is the one that works for me. It then opens up and forms a light seal which holds it in place. The great thing is that we can use it overnight and when traveling, swimming or exercising. To remove it, you pull the stem, then pinch the base to release the seal and pull it out. The good news is that you don't have to empty it as often as you are used to do with tampons or pads because the cup holds more. When forced to go to a public toilet, all you have to do is have a small bottle of water to be able to rinse the cup or just wipe it with some tissue. Just remember it's important to wash thoroughly your hands before handling it. It takes practice but once you get the hang of it, you'll love it. 
you'll have your cup removed or inserted in less than one minute. The only thought that comes to my mind when talking about menstrual cups. Wish I had learned about them earlier. I 100% recommend them to all women out there. Just give it a try. What have you got to lose? Of course, do your own research, but just give it a try. What about you? Have you or would you ever try a menstrual cup? Let me know your thoughts in the comments area down below. Thank you for spending this minute with me. I hope you have found this video useful and informative. Let me know with a big like under the video. Remember to subscribe the channel for more videos in the future. And um, I'll talk to you next week. Bye! to make sure you don't miss any of my beauty tips just remember to select the option email with new uploads as shown in the video